video, how the audio recording? How the audio recordings affected our case? Well, I mean, they were audio recordings of uh, our client. So, um, if the jury discards them as uh, evidence of guilt, obviously, they still have to look at whether there was supposed to be just a small fire or there was supposed to be this explosion. I don't think it uh, changes that, in, at least in the evidence part. Talk about the uh, effort to impeach the witness as far as showing, you know, he said, I didn't give away the medication. Uh, you showed, obviously, that he had told someone he did. Well, the, the point is, is that uh, he's a professional. He fed him medications and he worked him and he uh, wrote the letter himself as he testified to and and we believe that's the only reason this happened because Smith wanted to get out and he wanted to get money and I guess he wanted to be a star on a sitcom. But, but nobody made heard. your client make that telephone call. Why did he make the telephone call? Wow, that's not going to be easy here. What does that mean to your case? You had fought to keep that out. What's that? The evidence that... Well, because we thought the evidence shouldn't have come in because it was obtained in, in violation of the Constitution. And so we still maintain that. You guys have a good 4th of July.